Uh -huh. We're live. We're here. <laughs> For nobody who comes and watches these. <laughs> hey, I'm sure there's 37,000 people. You guys all show up later, just not when we're actually doing a live, which is fine. <laughs> Let's not talk about that. So we're here to talk about this. We are here. We are here. Cosmere. <laughs> this is the Cosmere box. And look at this. It is the crack of August 4th. Yeah, and we have them. And we have them in our hands. Yeah. That is because and I hear we things. were backers number like 268. We are going to drop that every time. Every time. Yep. <laughs> every time. Every time. But I'm excited. It's yes. Cosmere in general. And Brandon did say in his live this week that he was using something from this box while he was at the Tampa Bay Comic Con. And he was very excited about he it. He was very excited about it, so I am also very excited about it. And what did we say this week? We said we were sad. Oh. Because Cosm uh, because the the year. Yeah, that's it. Four There's more. Only four left. And only one more book. And one of them's a book. And so three boxes of swag. And I will be very sad. Let's open this. Wow. Okay. And now to end the moment of sadness, <laughs> we're gonna watch Heather slice her finger open. Okay, you might. This is a this is a really strong sticker. <laughs> you want to do Usually it? we do this beforehand. I know it's not going. Is I should get a going? knife. How I about get a knife. how about I use the scissors like scissors and cut? Yeah, maybe. Nicely. Okay, that is. It, that's really tough. Okay, try that technique. Okay. Ha! This means I get to unbox first. Yes, it does. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sprint too far ahead. I will open it up though. Read the quote. And read the quote. It says. This is not a quote from Wit. Always. Aim for the sun. That way, if you miss, at least your arrow will far will fall far away, and the person it kills will likely be someone you don't know. Okay, that's not a very good quote. That's an excellent quote. <laughs> I thought that was awesome. That's not a very good. Quote. Anyway, so we have we're not very familiar with this. We have yes. the fancy paper. Always we have the, the quote fancy. Oh, mine. mine in the lid. Mine four. Mine oh. Four. See, Look. the paper is a little abused this time. That tells it me is. there's something in here that, that that moved around. Yeah, let's see. Let's see what we got. Our papers. I mean, the cards first. Cards first. Are you gonna read it or am I? You know, I remember when I was little. <laughs> okay. And my brothers, mostly Larry, but my brothers would watch David Letterman sometimes and mm. he had a top 10 and he always did funny things with the card i don't i mean david letterman that's how old i am but like i i now get it if you have this card and you're talking and it's like you want to play with it yeah sorry i said him and jimmy fallon has his cards as well <clears throat> that he does you shouldn't be younger than me you said jimmy fallon said david letterman that's I fine i remember jimmy fallon but we are the same age he's so still on matter. the tv i know you remember him from i remember when i watched him in the good old days i don't watch him anymore okay Wow, back to the boxes. <laughs> Spoiler warning, this box contains the Cosmere. Well, a little piece of it anyway. Brandon's interconnected universe of fantasy stories is in full swing and continues to expand like our universe. Mm -hmm. Find your nearest perpendicularity and let's get world hopping. That's an exciting intro. It is an exciting intro. Maybe we entry. should live it up and we should like try to like read them together or something sometime. No. That would be the next level. So, we only have four more to go. we got to up our game. For the cell box, I opened up all of my things and you read it. So I should read them and you should open up your things. Okay. That sounded like you said the same thing twice. All right. You want me to read or open? I was going to read and you open. Oh, okay. Okay. For number one, World Hopper Toiletry Bag. Toiletry. You... <laughs> You travel in style. Why can't your toiletries do so as well? From the cut to the fabric to the, from the cut to the fabric to the zipper poles, every element has specifically has been specifically customized, making this a designer bag in every sense of the phrase. But why stop at toiletries? Cards, dice, miniatures, crafts—you name it. If it fits, this can hold it. Can I just say I'm excited for the plastic bag it came in? <laughs> I'm like a little kid at Christmas. Like this dragon steel bag should have another life. I'm gonna work on that. You're, yeah, you should gift something else in that. Wow. Wow. Okay. <laughs> this. How do I describe? This is funny. This. This. Like it's a plasticky but very it is a substantial yeah. material. Yeah. And and it says World Hopper on it. Yes, it does. But Cosmetics. 
if you look in the light, it has the Cosmere symbol, symbol. thingy on it. I don't know if that's going to come through. Anyway, wow. Should we unzip it? I've never been more excited in my life to receive a purse. Oh, look, it has the constellations in there for each of the planets. Uh huh. Scadrial, Nalthus, Roshar. Can you see that? I don't know if they can see that. I don't know. Wow. I'm Good impressed. thing he gave us this card that said toiletry bag because I might have said this is like a mini lunchbox. No, that's what but we're getting not. when we go to Dragon Steel. Oh. Very nice toiletry bag. It, it has is. a mesh pocket on the inside and a plastic see through pocket here with wow. zipper. And can I just say that while I do believe in personal hygiene, I don't believe I own this many toiletries. I don't think you do either. I, I normally bring the toiletries and then we just use good old gallon size Ziploc baggies. Oh, not anymore. Or less than that. Of course, not, as always, am I going to want to scar this? I'm awesome going to use interior. mine. Oh, look, there's a tag in the in here, and it says, it is the journey that shapes us. Oh. They put a random tag with no other information but another quote from the I book. actually think it's awesome because this says World Hopper. Yes. And so you're traveling, and, and you're going to different worlds. And so does this. It also Genius. says there. And okay. it has a little handle, so you can hang it on something or carry it. And it's gender neutral. Male or female can use it. It's not overly flowery. <laughs> you would not be embarrassed to pull that out of your bag. Okay, only you might because still it be says World Hopper on it. <laughs> I, I still you think might it's still cool. be embarrassed. I still think it's cool. I want a thing. Oh, does it have? So it looks like so. There's these hangy things on the side. Oh, I'm trying to figure bet, out, but there I is bet, an additional yeah, thing. Yeah, I bet they're in there. Oh no, but this is. Uh, what's? What's their next me, thing? Okay. What else is in the box? World Hopper tag. Clearly mark what is yours with this sturdy and beautifully designed tag. Your luggage, your backpack, your friends. It doesn't matter what you tag so long as you have their permission. Oh. Okay, this is a really fun themed box. It's all yes. about travel. Look at this. Oh, and then that's are you ready awesome. for it? Wait for it. Bam. That is so cool. Oh, that's really cool. That is super cool. How fun. Seriously, the creative team at Dragon Steel, they have knocked it out of the park every month. And it has this little card for my personal information. I know. Good thing we're traveling soon. I'm totally it's... using this. This is one that's not going to get left in the pristine nope. box. Nope. Most of our stuff still sits. You probably can't see it. We have our boxes on the top of our bookcase. Most of our stuff still sits in the box on top of our bookcase. <laughs> Except for some of the display swag items are... Our lovely uh, bookends, yes, the pins are true. out, that's our true. We did, we did put our pins here. Did you see this? So I'm a part of a Stormlight group on Facebook, and somebody posted a picture. They were just posting a picture of something else, but I saw that they had put their pins like this, and I was like, oh, great idea for something to use my pins for. It's genius. Anyway, I'm still geeking out over this. <laughs> I know, that's really This fun. thing is super cool. You'll know it's your bag. Yes, I will. We don't check a bag very often. I have to be careful this doesn't get stolen. You would. I have to get locked for my world hopper tag. Anyway, okay, super cool. What else? Okay, next. Cosmere destination postcards. Ever get so lost in a book that you forget to connect with your friends and family? Keep in touch with these retro inspired postcards depicting must see Cosmere locations or just keep them for yourself. That's what Probably we're gonna do. Probably keep them for myself. Yeah. Okay, this. Bag does not say Dragon Steel on it, so I'm just sacrificing it the does, bag. Oh, yeah, that plastic bag. No, the bag that the 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 luggage tag came in also was a fancy really Dragon Steel and bag. Thick, like yeah. super thick and sturdy. I said I want to think of something to use that for because. Okay, so this is a little envelope. Bing. <laughs> Did I just try to do a bing? And these are cards. Bing. bing. Yeah, that's what he does because he goes yes. bing. Thirty percent. These cards are now Bing. being 100% done. Yes. Oh boy. Okay. You're a Thiru. I can tell you right now, these are going on my wall. Yeah. And they are on the back set up to be postcards. You could mail them, but who's going to mail that? That's awesome. You would have to uh, really like someone or have so many of these. Oh. Oh no. Okay, this is one of my favorite books of his. Shadows for Silence in the Forest of Hell. It's a short story. It's only like two and a half hours audio. 
and I want him to write more about that world and there it is, Forest of Hell. These are cool. Okay, on the back there is, oh, we're gonna have to read each one of these. So on that one, one, it says, the Forest of Hell offer ample opportunities to encounter the lingering investiture of those who have passed from the physical realm. It's also a wonderful place to become one such lingering wisp of investiture. <sighs> For a less permanent adventure, visit a way stop and be regaled with stories from fellow travelers, many of whom have bounties on their heads. Not that you heard that from us. So they have descriptions of these places. Which is super fun. Yeah, that is really fun. Are we reading all of these? Oh, you don't have to read them all. Okay. Okay. Because you're a Thiru. So I, I am, I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed. Why are you I don't know some of these. Oh. So this is like flashcards. Okay. <laughs> Elantris. Elantris. Okay, we all know Elantris. Yes. And... White Sands. Ah. Yeah. Is it Kazare? Oh, uh, Kazare? I don't know. It's not a, I don't know. It is? Okay. I've only read those once. They're on the shelf right there. I should... Obviously, I need to reread them. How about this one? To tell her. To tell her. Oh, ha. This is why you got to be careful <laughs> only listening to audiobooks. Because you don't know how things are spelled. So people yes. talk about all the time. If you read the books, you know how they're spelled, but you don't know how they're pronounced. And if you listen to them, you know how they're pronounced, but not how they're spelled. Yes. So I did not know that's how that was. Okay. And, and then Luthadel. That one. That, yeah. that one's iconic. Anyway, that is. Those are really cool. Super cool. Never sending those off to anybody. Nope. We have to In fact, I'm trying hard now. to not bung the edges. Yep. Okay. Excellent. And it comes in an awesome little envelope. And yeah, very good. Manufactured by Inventor's Guide www.inventorsguide.com. I feel like several of his other things were also from them. From them. I don't. That's not 100. Well, percent I don't know. Interesting. I don't know. Okay, and then finally, big Number finale. Number two, Cosmere character pin. Intensely mm. interested in how magic works throughout the Cosmere, Chris studies, catalogs, and theorizes about each one. We've seen her on several planets. Now she's on yours. Okay, I can't even tell you what character she is. Yeah. Wow. I am such a slacker. That's like three times today I didn't get a reference, and I'm supposed to be better than this. So, obviously... I, I don't know her reference. I don't know what book she... Yeah, I'm trying to think what, what other she's name she's, she goes by, right? She's we got... were theorizing previously uh -oh. about which characters we thought they were going to do because there was only five left now there's only four left and this character was not even chris studies theory by each one is she one of the <laughs> see we read it too fast um the last wax and wane the lost metal was she in that one like working with, with maracy yeah maracy maybe wow okay well we will we will do better with our homework for next time. Uh yeah. I feel like I I feel like I missed something. I missed something. Yep. Should I look it up? Uh well you can. But now there's but that's all of the unboxing. Um while you look it up, I'll read the bottom of the box. Evie oh. said, Hey guys, I'm a little bit late. Oh. Is that I don't know if I said that correctly, but hello. I'm looking up this character because we've been appropriately humbled. I know. I feel like I've been I've been chastised. But thank you. I have the best fans in the world. You've proven that to me time and again. You are awesome. You are amazing. You have incredible taste in books. And I believe that each box says that on the bottom. Okay. From Mistborn. Appears in the Bands of Mourning. Okay. Huh. Okay, we're going to the Copper Mine. Go in the Copper Mine. Which, it's probably not incredibly uh, intriguing to watch you look up stuff on your phone. No. But... Uh, you are welcome to all educate us. Yes, please educate us. <laughs> and and uh, yeah, but that's it. That's so. Uh, hopefully, you guys got one of these and are enjoying it like we will. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure I'm going to use mine. Oh, it's warm in here. I'm not sure I'm going to use mine for the purpose intended. I think no. I'll use it. I think I'll use it for something else. I'll use mine. I will, and I'll put and I'll put Chris, who I now know. Who she is. I'm going to put her on my 
Bookends. Excellent. Yeah. Okay. Well, that was fun. As always, only four more to go. We'll be very sad when that happens, but oh, well. all good things must come to an end. But then we will have the Kickstarter for Words of Radiance. That's true. And Stormlight 5. Stormlight and 5. And all the things. Yes. There will be more things. There's always more things, so. Brandon. So anyways, thank you. Yeah.